Hello everybody. Today we are going to make giraffe uh, using just two balloons. One balloon we are going to use to make the head and another balloon we will use to make the body. Inflate first yellow balloon leaving about 4 inch flat tail. Let's twist a chain of the first two about 3 inch long bubbles. Lock both ends of the chain of the first two bubbles in one lock twist. We are going to make bird body twist. Then we twist the third about 3 inch long bubble. Lock free end of the third bubble between the first and the second bubbles. Then we twist the chain of the next two about 2 inch long bubbles. And we lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Now we twist the six about 2 inch long bubble. And then we lock the free end of the sixth bubble between the fourth and the fifth bubbles. You have to roll the fourth and the fifth bubbles around the sixth bubble. The next two bubbles we twist to make the eyes. Let's twist a chain of the next two about two inch long bubbles. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. We have made the eyes. Now let's twist the ninth about five, maybe six inch long bubble. Lock both ends of the ninth bubble in one lock twist. We have made one ear. And now we have to twist the tenth bubble of the same length as we made the ninth bubble. And we lock both ends of the tenth bubble in one lock twist. The rest of the balloon is the eleventh bubble. We are going to keep it. It will represent the horn. Yes, our giraffe will have two horns. Let's fix all bubbles in proper positions. Alright, we have made the head of giraffe with one horn. Now let's inflate the second yellow balloon, leaving about no more than 3 inch long flat tail. We are going to use this balloon to make the body of uh, our giraffe with a horn. Uh, let's start with the tail. Twist the first about 2 inch long bubble, it is a tail. Twist the second about 2 inch long bubble, twist the third and fourth about half an inch long bubbles. Twist the fifth about 2 inch long bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last four bubbles in one lock twist. We have made the rear legs. Twist the sixth about 2 inch long bubble. Now we are making the front legs the same size as we did the rear legs. 2 inch long, half an inch, half an inch, 2 inch long bubbles. And then we lock both ends of the chain of the last four bubbles in one lock twist. The rest of the balloon is the eleventh bubble. It will represent the neck. Ok, so far we have made the body with a long neck. And we have made a head with one horn. Now we have to attach the body with a neck to the head. Let's uh, make the second horn. Twist the twelfth bubble at the very end of the second balloon. Make it the same size as we did the last bubble of the first balloon. And now we lock the free end of the twelfth bubble of the second balloon between the air bubbles. Then we fix all bubbles in proper positions. Bend the neck bubble to shape it properly. That's it, we have made the giraffe. I'm going to use a permanent black marker to draw the face of the giraffe. And then we paint spots all over the body, neck, everywhere you want. Congratulations again, we have made the giraffe. Our giraffe has horns. So let's call it Daddy Giraffe. Some other time we will make the rest of the family as well. Have fun and happy twisting.